Hey everyone, my name is Andrew Peek. I'm a web developer and I specialize in SEO and web advertising. I'm going to share with you some Google AdWords tips and tricks. Let's get started. Our first tip today is to use long tail keywords when adding keywords to your advert. Your objective here is to target a very specific customer who is searching for a very specific product. For example, I'm searching hitch bike rack into the keyword tool and I will bring up other phrases that are commonly searched for that are related to hitch bike rack. The phrases such as trailer hitch bike rack, hitch mount bike rack, receiver hitch bike rack will all bring in very specific customers to my ad that will hopefully click on my ad and purchase my product. Your likelihood of a um, conversion after the click is much higher with these very specific long tail keyword phrases versus hitch bike rack or bike rack. Again, your entire goal with AdWords is to spend the least amount of money all while selling the most product. This is why targeting the very generic keywords for most businesses does little more than drain your wallet and leave you very frustrated with Google AdWords. Alright, so our second tip today is to have to create effective ads. Our objective here is to have Google bold the majority of our text. Google will bold your text in the ad that is what the user searched for. So if you have in there have in your ad hitch mounted bike rack and the user searched hitch mounted bike rack, that portion of your ad will be bolded. So to do this there's a trick and you use the Google keyword variable and to do that you put in a curly bracket and then type keyword and then have the end curly bracket and that will insert what the user searched for into that top headline. But in case the user searched for a long phrase that won't fit in this character limit, you need to have something separating the keyword with the colon and you'll have a phrase that will be inserted into there when the search phrase is too long. So in this ad I'm going to, I'm going to have hitch mounted bike rack. And second line I like to have product features that you know will be what the customer is looking for along with that will be bolded by Google. So I'm going to have hitch bike rack 200 200 pound limit and I might be able to fit in there weight limit let's see weight limit and there we go that will you know let them know that I have a 200 pound weight limit on this bike rack in description line 2 I like to put something in there that will give the user a level of trust with the ad or give the ad an identity so the company I work for we can usually offer the lowest price so I like to put in there guarantee lowest price online and this will give them another incentive to click on that ad and this is another trick and the display URL you need to have the URL that will be I mean the domain the same domain as the destination URL so I'm going to put in here www.domain.com but after that you could put in anything you like so you could put in here test 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 but that won't do any good. So I'm going to put hitch bike rack. And those that hitch bike rack will be bolded if the user searched hitch bike rack, which this is what we're targeting. So hopefully that will be bolded. And again, put your keywords in here, your long tail keywords, as that's what we are targeting. And put in your max bid, whatever that may be. You know, I like to do something low, and then if I need to increase it, then I increase it. But I don't usually start very high unless it is a high keyword that no matter what it's going to be a high cost per click and then hit save and finish.